This is DITW Anatomy and Physiology, and you are now watching the video on hematopoietic stem cells. The hematopoietic stem cell is a type of stem cell found in the bone marrow, which is derived from one of the embryonic germ layers called the mesoderm. Over time, the hematopoietic stem cell will differentiate into each of the different formed elements of the blood, which includes erythrocytes, the red blood cells, leukocytes, the white blood cells, and thrombocytes, platelets. Each formed element follows their own unique path to creation, all starting as a hematopoietic stem cell. Let's break down this chart to show you how each cell is created, starting from the hematopoietic stem cell. Starting from the hematopoietic stem cell, you can follow one of two paths. The hematopoietic stem cell will differentiate either into the myeloid stem cell or lymphoid stem cell. Let us start by exploring the path going down the myeloid stem cell path. The myeloid stem cell can differentiate down four different paths, either platelet, red blood cell, or certain types of white blood cells. For the platelet path, the myeloid stem cell will change from a megakaryoblast and then into a megakaryocyte. For the red blood cell, the myeloid stem cell will change from a proerythroblast into a reticulocyte. And for white blood cells, they will either differentiate into a myeloblast or a monoblast. From this point, each of these cells will then differentiate into either the platelet, red blood cell, or one of these four white blood cells, which include the basophil, neutrophil, eosinophil, and monocyte. Now let's go back to the beginning of this chart and let's go down the lymphoid stem cell path. This path is a lot simpler. As soon as it becomes a lymphoid stem cell, it will differentiate down only one path to the lymphoblast. And from there, this will differentiate down two paths, either creating natural killer cells or a lymphocyte, which is the last uh, white blood cell. Hopefully that has made this chart a little bit more understandable to see how everything differentiates and how the formed elements of the blood uh, all stem from the same stem cell, the hematopoietic stem cell. Thank you very much for watching. If you found this video helpful, please make sure to like. Please comment any questions you have related to anatomy and physiology and make sure to subscribe to know when future videos become available.